Welcome back to Metro Exodus. Before I actually press continue, I just wanted to show you how the menu has changed since the last time we were in it. So before it was just the train, uh, I guess, at a stop, nobody in it, just kind of empty. And now that we've actually gone somewhere in it, it's changed to show how we're traveling. It shows our kilometers up here, 777, Anna's just having a drink. Uh, there's all sorts of cool stuff around here, like the map and cup of something up there, just sloshing around and that dog tag flipping around and god, everything's just so cool. It's an amazing menu. It's such a great idea to have it actually grow and change to reflect what you're doing in the game. Okay, now let's continue and press the flippy buttons. Okay, we have been let loose for the first time in the entire game. It took about two hours to get here, actually. The first destination on the train. We need to figure out what's going on here with the blockade, who blockaded us. Uh, I think we need some parts to fix the train, or maybe they're just fixing the train and it's just going to take some time. But uh, yeah, our goal right now is to head over in that direction, check out that little possible settlement, see what's going on. Going with Anna. Looks like I've got two weapons on me. I've got this thing with iron sights. Got the pistol with the silencer and a uh, red dot. Have a decent amount of ammo for this thing, actually, but very little for this. 21 loaded plus 5 in reserve. 13 minutes of gas masks time, although I don't know when we're going to need it because the air here is okay. Oh, I want to go over there and check out that boat. There's a shack down there. I wanna, well, yeah, I wanna go everywhere. Remember, this game's open world, so you probably can go there. Although you probably can't swim, so maybe not. Fucking hell, this game's so good looking. Do I leave footsteps in the snow? I can't tell, there's already too many footsteps. Oh, hey, I do have this little hand thing again. I just press down, I uh, hold down the light button instead of pressing it. You just tap it, turns it on and off, hold it down. And you get the little squeezy thing. I freaking love this thing. Looks like we're already maxed, though. Got some radiation in here. Probably all the metallic objects, right? And don't those absorb radiation more than other things? Ooh, crafting parts. Be there in a second, Anna. I wonder if I have to look out for traps. Press I to craft survival consumables and customize your weapons. Or L, rather. No, not L. Hold I. Right, our super special backpack that's sort of like a mobile crafting thing. Uh... Maybe when we're outside. Oh, I know you can handle yourself, Anna. Come on. I love the snowy stalks. Can we save your game? Oh, you can save yourself? I guess so there's a uh, manual save as well as the checkpoint system. That's cool. Quick save. F5 probably does a quick save, right? Maybe? I just pressed F5. I didn't do anything. Oh, it says saving.
So if I press F5, go to the menu, saving. Yeah, just, I'm, I'm not really getting any feedback that it's saving, but it seems like it does do it when I press F5. Listen to those mud noises. тебе значит не придется местные видимо в основном по реке передвигаются oh, is there a vehicle system like do you actually get to ride the boat if so then we probably can check that stuff out over there thanks oh my god yeah so this game has vehicles of a sort. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, hey, what's that? Huge crab monster thing. Oh, hmm. Uh. Yeah, that's probably not good. Oh, you even push those little ice things out of the way. Hey, bird. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to be checking out the church, right? Oh, I was stuck on, like, going over there, but... Nope. Nope. Look at how used this boat looks. Peeling paint, leaves in the bottom of it. I assume we can kind of, like, get out at these flag areas. Or I guess we can probably get out any area. What happens if you just jump in the water? I mean, do we instantly die, or...? <laughs> this church feels familiar. From one of the past Metro games. Wasn't there a church-like place that we were at, at at night in one of the past Metro games? Being chased by monsters all over the place? It wasn't underwater, though. Might have been swampy. Is that a white flag? Yeah, I'm not gonna fire at them. What's the best way there? We should probably take the boat, huh? <laughs> Get out of my boot. they're yelling at me for a second. It sounded a... Whoa. Did I see her shot? Not from here, but from far away. I see a kid up there, too. Hi. Oh, that's a big warning sign. Народ у нас мирный, не стоит их пугать. Ну, добро пожаловать. Hmm. They sound like a cult. That child just ran away. Obviously trying to get away, not from me, but trying to get away from that person. Oh, shit. 
философское искушение электричеством и прочими соблазнами. Вы злые, злые, никого вы не спасаете. Yeah, you dumb kid. Call my friends and my daddy. The heretic is trapped for so will the Lord. All right, so we're gonna have to shoot them all, aren't we? I'm coming. I'm assuming you're going this way. Are you up here? Ah. Locked us up here a year ago. Да, мостовики говорить серетиками не станут. А я все все расскажу. Уж посмотрела из ягодка. Ох, техноборцы! Подручные силанти выявились. Он их как и здешних окрутил, только эти с ружьями. Уходите. Тут спуск есть. А на пристани лодка стоит. И у нас есть. Только маленькая очень. Okay, stay safe. Man, I really want to check out this place. It's really interesting looking, but we gotta go. Not mean to take that. You found a weapon modification. Use your backpack to install it. Uh, does does time pause when I use my backpack? No. I mean, why would it? Uh, I guess I'll try to do it now. Seems like nobody's around. Light hand can grip to reduce weapon weight. So, what am I looking at? Oh, I see. These are the ones I can choose from. Either light grip or sniper stock. Greatly reduces recoil. So the only downside of that is the weight? I guess I'll go with the sniper stock then? Yeah. Okay. Suppressor or short belt? Definitely suppressor. Reflex sight, iron sight, definitely reflex sight. Three shot cylinder. Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, that's enough for now. This thing looks like a little shotgun. Can't cover you when you're inside. Trying to be just maybe the woman and child. No, you can handle this just fine. Okay. I feel a need to like read out the text for some reason. Let's just stop for a second. I feel like I should read out the text, kind of, but I shouldn't. I mean, it's subtitles. I should just let you read it. It's fine. I read text, but not spoken text. I don't know. I don't. I guess I don't play games that aren't in English very often. The spoken language, anyway, it feels strange. But yeah, I'm not gonna read it. Can I shoot these to put them out? Can I put them out at all? Shit. Okay. Well. I wish I could lean around corners. Nah, 
Might as well turn my light on. They know where I am. Oh fuck, no ammo. I think they're just like right around the corner. Don't forget to craft ammunition and survival consumables. Hmm. Well, I don't think I'm going to do that during combat, but thank you. God damn. Take a lot of damage from hits, huh? It is on hardcore after all. Giving up? So that's a thing. Does that happen when there's only a few of them left? Uh, well, I guess I'll knock them out. <laughs> that's interesting. That's new. <laughs> they got a little fishing lure on them, I think. I maybe want to take some of their weapons, actually. There's some shotguns. That would be pretty good, actually. Especially considering I have literally no ammunition for this. Yes, let's take it. Does this thing just hold one shot at a time? Yeah, wow. I hope that's powerful. I guess they've probably all given up. Yep, yeah, put it down. Thwack. <laughs> Children's little <laughs> bicycle in here. That's creepy, actually. Okay, buddy. Cool it. No demonology for you, buddy. Ooh. I mean, does it really matter if I hit these? It really doesn't, but I guess they're crafting components, looks like. Another icon up here. Does that mean, like, new place to go? Yeah. Over there. Well, not just yet. I'm definitely not done with this place. so cool. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. You can break canned goods and then they drop the thing that was canned inside of them. Hey, piggy. Bunnies. 
Can I let him out? Mm -hmm. Just eat your grass, little squeakers. Everything will be fine. This place is just a maze. Mmm. Oh, was that a bunch of flies getting on my screen? Oh, that's gross. Okay, I guess we're done with this place, seems like. For the most part? Hmm. I wonder what's in there. Also locked. They said they would get back to the train on their own, right? The, uh, the person and the child? Yeah, alright, I, I guess I'll move on. Oh! Yeah, not good. You just instantly die? Or... Oh. It just put me back up here automatically, thank you. Maybe if you're near the boat when you go in the water, it does that. And if you're not, you probably just die. Or maybe you end up back where you came from, where you jumped off. Yeah, that's so cool. When you look at your map, you don't row anymore because you're using your hands to look at the map. Yeah, they already made it. And I need to be better at stealth, obviously. Is that little, like, exclamation mark with the radio symbol? It keeps appearing. What does that mean? I know I have a radio here, but I guess that's just being used to hear what I just heard. I don't think I can actually specifically use it. Oh, okay. Beefy thing. Artyom, сюда. Oh, that one's bigger. So I guess we've never seen anything like that. Меня вообще старик в дозор отправил. Говорит, сиди тихо, приключений на жопу себе не ищи, без крайней необходимости не вмешивайся. Вот я за тобой смотрел. С оккупантами, я так понял, ты по-тихому управился. Молитвами и крестным знаменем? Thanks. Аня уже рассказала про сектантов. А может поменяемся с тобой, а? А то я так и вернусь в Москву, не сделав ни одного выстрела. Я девчонку там yeah, okay. отбить пытался. Да где там? Oh. Too much radiation? Так всегда другим. Вот мельник на тебя. Looks like it's in the yellow. Oh, gas mask. Хрен знает, или сосуд жить хочет. I'm just walking away from Duke while they're talking. It's so rude. Why for radiation detector? Do I need a gas mask here? Oh, what are those things? They're so cool. I guess some of these spots need it. I'll just leave it on. Yeah, so why for radiation? Almost in the yellow. Oh, 
Oh, there it is. Or there's another one. These places look so lived in. Amazing amount of detail. Ugh. What is that exactly? That's a different type of pistol altogether, isn't it? Wait, is that even a pistol? No, it's like a submachine gun, I guess. Hmm, I'd rather have this. Looks like it uses the same ammo, so I don't want to waste it. <laughs> Should I try to shoot it? Well, that's probably a bad idea. Oh, yeah! Holy shit. Why am I doing this? Can anything good come from this? Maybe? I mean, if it- if I kill it, can I really go out there to even get the loot? It would be good to kill it though, so next time I use the boat I don't have to deal with it. It could be literally indestructible. Okay, that was literally my last shot. Um, I think it's- either indestructible or has an extraordinary amount of health. <laughs> let's, let's stay away from the shore. Oh! Oh my god, that's so cool! A little rabbit den. Yeah, it's following me. I was hoping there'd be something out here. Uh, just submerged houses. Okay, back to the tree where Duke pulled us out. Speaking of, where did Duke go? Anyway, it looks like there's a downed plane over here. Let's check that out. Don't forget about your journal. Look at the map, check your current objective. Yep. Gotta make it back to the train. Yeah. There's gotta be some stuff in here. Great for your gear. This thing looks pretty good. Do I have some ammo for it? Yeah. Oh. Is this a sniper? No, it can't be. It's got 21 shots in the magazine. Just an assault rifle with a scope. Looks really nice. Oh, holding down R didn't unload that, actually. It scrapped it for parts, didn't it?
Action of the train. Oh, is that a demon up there? I'm coming. I'm just out of breath. I wish being out of breath didn't sound like I needed to heal. Well, you stopped shooting, so I'm going to stop for a second and see if I can find some more stuff. You stop shooting, they're fine. Простите, нет. Ну, мы нигде особо и не были. Глушь одна, ты только. А, понял. Артем, подойди-ка. Артем, Артем, зайди после бати ко мне. Кто ж тебя подарок дожидает? Артем молодец, что спас их. Катерина сообщила нам важную информацию. В порту скрывается некий крест. Механик. Его помощь нам необходима, чтобы привести Аврору в порядок в разумные сроки. Ермак один не справляется. Так что, как будешь готов, давай в порт за крестом и сразу обратно. Будем думать, что с этими святошами на мосту делать. А теперь мы точно знаем, что мост в работоспособном состоянии. Они по нему сюда год назад перебрались. Но хоть что-то знаем, потому что в целом только запуталось все сильнее. А, оккупантов именно здесь может и вовсе не быть. Они наверняка держат только ключевые районы. А, в любом случае, добравшись до Ямантау, мы узнаем все. Из источника высочайшего уровня. Руководство Москвы — это так, местное самоуправление, по сути. Так что сейчас нам нужно как можно быстрее преодолеть этот проклятый мост. So that's our next goal. Um, there's probably some stuff to. Artyom, ты еще здесь? Выдвигайся лучше в порт. I got you. I got you. I think we have some business aboard the train, the Aurora. Хорошо бы твоя мама с нами поехала. Была бы у нас команда. Одна лечит, другая калечит. Катя, Настя, идите чай пить. Не стесняйтесь. Спасибо. А вы, Катя, откуда вообще родом? С Южного Урала. Пару лет назад услышали, что место на Волге есть хорошее. Вот и приехали сюда. Кто ж знал, что тут сектанты власть захватили? А раньше, говорят, тут хорошо было. А вы с мужем приехали? Нас 15 человек было. А с... They're hitting on the person we just saved. Сейчас только мы с Настей остались. Простите. А ты чего куксишься? Чай невкусный? Вкусный. Да, как Гаргулья налетела, Настя Мишку потеряла. А та, видно, решила, что живое. И унесла. У -у -у. Не переживай. Найдем мы твоего Мишку. А мы в Москве этих тварей... Это просто что я могу сделать. Найти на тарибер. Гаргулями. Интересно. Это да. И откуда они только такие на нашу голову? Ну, радиация, химическое оружие, опять же... Вот природа и не выдержала. Ну да, угробили планету. 
Потому Силантию тут все в рот и заглядывают. Не мудрено, если каждый день такое видишь. Жалко их дураков. Живут в потьмах, мрут в потьмах, болеют, харкают. Я училась на медсестру. Да Силантии слышать не хочет, чтобы лечить кого. Господь, говорит, своих прибирает. Одна забота у него, как помрут рыбе это скормить. Так, мол, точно в рай попадут. Я пыталась, конечно, что-то сделать, но куда там? Грех. А потом... Oh, so that giant thing that attacked us, it sounds like the, uh... I already forgot their name. Started with an S, the person who led this cult. Sounds like they actually worship it. They just want to feed bodies to the fish. Потом он и вовсе нас на колоколь не запер. И главное, из-за чего? Из-за фонарика электрического. Не фонарик дядя Крест подарил. Но Силанти ругался сильно и разбил его. Разбил. А Креста анафеме предал. А вот тот в порт и убежал. Там звера люди, и сектанты туда лезть боятся. А Силанти еще маму на себе женить хочет. Но она не хочет, он старый и противный. Бэ. Да. Про брак у рыбы этой чертовой никаких заповедей нету. Или дочку отбила. Мерзко от него, бесноватого мерзко. Вы ведь вытащите нас отсюда, заберете? Заберем, конечно. Не переживайте. I imagine we're gonna be getting a lot of people to come on board our train. People that we rescue that want to come with us, right? I wonder if we're gonna find other uh train cars to hook on to the end of this train and make it bigger because it's not very big you know it's really really not а у меня тут для тебя подарок. a present Тихарь, помнишь? Но мощи хоть отбавляй. oh И yeah легче, делать, хоть на главное давление в баллоне держи а то не выстрел получится пшик в остальном безотказная штука Уж я постарался. Thanks. Так что носись с честью. <laughs> ну и не забывай ко мне заглядывать периодически. У меня тут еще есть кое-какие идеи, как его улучшить. Pump them by holding down R and pressing left mouse button. <laughs> Ah, it looks like it has a... I think that's a similar system to how it was in the previous Metro games, where you can kind of over-pressurize it. Not that it hurts it or anything, but when it's in the red there, it will... Like, you want to use it right then and there to get that extra damage, and if you don't, then it'll go down to a more moderate safe level. It should stop at 8, I think. Let's see if it does. Yep. Then it was automatic. Are there weapon modes to switch between automatic and semi? Let me check. Mm, doesn't look like it, or at least there isn't a distinct control for it. But of course, there's a lot of multifunction controls where it's like hold this button down to do a different thing. So it might exist, and I just don't know about it. Man, look at all the details on this weapon. It's so cool. Look at that serial number on the very back of it and how it's like kind of misprinted, you know, like it wasn't stamped on perfectly. It's so cool. All that tape around the tube, that blue tape around the tube right next to the wristwatch. Man, I just love the attention to detail they put in all this stuff. So that's a third weapon, right? Yeah, now I got three weapons, which I think is the max I can carry. At least at the moment. Артём, ты в порт? Я Лёшу скоро меняю, так что прости, не могу с тобой. У него рука до сих пор ноет. Как кстати, что Катя медсестра. Легче будет отца убедить взять их. Yeah, having a nurse is great. Позже на этот счет подойду. Да и видно, что ему самому не хочется их здесь оставлять. Но он так зациклился на поиске этих оккупантов, что ни о чем другом и думать не может. Ладно, 
Иди, куда там тебя отец отправил. Только осторожней. Я волнуюсь все же. I've seen the kilometer tracker in the bottom right show up enough that I think that's actually the the game just saved indicator. I think that's what it is. Let me press F5. Yep. Took it a couple seconds to save, and then it popped up. Let's press it again. F5. Yeah! So it's not only tracking how far you've come from Moscow, but it's also the indicator that you saved. That's really clever. It's very clever. Dual purpose. Okay, well, now that we're nice and safe, let's check out our backpack and see what we can craft. Okay, so as far as stuff I can craft, it looks like uh, this is how much it's going to cost of each thing. You can also dismantle it if you have extra of it to get some crafting parts. Up here in the top left is how much I have of each thing. Um, this this tells you how many you're going to get out of it. So for a lot of things, it's just one. You get one med kit for this, one filter for that. But other things like these little steel balls for use in the, the T-car, the pneumatic rifle I just got. Each crafting of it gives you ten. So we have no med kits. Let's go ahead and craft at least one of those. Have to press E. Yeah. Yeah, that should be fine. I think I have too much of this, to be honest. Let's dismantle a couple. Let's craft another med kit, actually. Let's craft some more steel balls. It's just because you get 10 out of it and it costs 10 of these things. It's basically one of this equals one steel ball. Pretty generous. But again, it can be auto-fire, so if you just spray those, then those ten balls are going to go pretty fast. You can make throwing knives and cans and whatnot. I don't use decoys very much, so let's just dismantle a couple. Oh, do you know where my other two throwing knives went, by the way? I threw them at the fish thing. It didn't work. Now this over here, I don't think this is crafting at all. I think this is just for weapon customization. As far as I can tell, you can't do any crafting in this menu. Um, but let's take a look at what we got. So, the T-car. Whoa. Okay, right click does that. Now I know. So for the T-car, we got two different types of grips. Light grip and forehand, or sniper stock grip and forehand. Greatly reduces recoil. Uh, I don't think there's really any advantage to this other one. Worse stability. Maybe weighs less, but does weight actually matter? Like, is there actually a weight counter in my inventory or anything like that? Some sort of a limit? Doesn't seem like it. So, let's go with that. Standard max system, iron sights, a reflex sight, reflex sight, of course. Just the one magazine, just that. Okay, not much to do there. Ah, we already put the sniper stock on the pistol. Ooh. So there's also a standard barrel that I can put on it, but that's not silenced, so... Nope, definitely, <clears throat> definitely want the suppressor. Nothing there, nothing there. What about this thing, the Kalash? That's the new gun I just got and haven't really used. 4X scope or iron sights. 4X scope. Oh, look at how grimy this scope is. It's so cool. So used and really, really needs to be clean cleaned. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, so didn't you say something about, like, keeping weapons clean and stuff? Can I clean this thing? Because it needs it desperately. You wanna... You wanna take the... Take the thing? Okay. Sure. Oh, hey, now that we're somewhere else. I can probably find different radio stations, right? Wait, where's, where's the radio station? Why is this room so empty? What the hell happened to everything? Okay, goodbye. 
All right, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we are going to head over there to find the person that can help us repair the Aurora.